Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So I got an email from a subscriber, and this subscriber sent the donation, so thanks for your donation. And remember, guys, if you want to guarantee that your question will be answered, make sure you click the link below and send a donation. So this one says, what's up, Mr. Locario? I first want to thank you for the YouTube videos you put out each week. Your advice has been helpful in putting me in the right mindset and being able to get girls interested. I'm 19 and in college right now, and I want to know how can how can and I have more sex during my time here. I found that I can hook up with girls better at parties, but when it comes to during the day or with or with girls I know uh, that I struggle a bit. For example, there's this girl in my social circle that I want to get with, but I'm unsure about the best way to go about it. So I would like to know how can I best reel her in as well as other girls that I know, as it seems that the warm approach is a lot different than the cold approach. Uh, your help would be greatly appreciated i also want to say keep doing what you're doing uh guys who were shy like me benefit from your advice all right so you know first thing is you gotta you know gotta stop being shy and stuff but um but what i would say is this you know when you're trying to get these girls that's in your social circle right um the the, the advantages you have is that they know you you understand you know them they know you right so all you really need to do at this point is you need to isolate her from everyone else in the social circle and have some time where you and her are together alone. And then once you're alone, that's when you flirt and make your move. You understand? So, for example, you know, since you said you in college and all of that, you know, you could tell her like, hey, you know, you should come by my dorm. And we can, you know, watch some Netflix or something like that. You understand? Or tell her like, hey, you know what you're doing after class is go get something to eat. And then whenever you have her, by herself with you that's when you start the flirting that's when you start building a sexual tension and then she will respond and let you know if she's down to make it happen you understand it's really that simple now you know what i would say um you know the fact that you're in college and stuff and you're saying you know how do i have more sex in these situations is that you know since you're in college you know don't just designate yourself to the girls you already know and, and, and spend a whole bunch of time with them. You understand? Like, don't, don't do that. Like you want to, um, first, you, you know, since you have so many women that's going to be around, you want to be able to spread your game around. So, you know, you can end up knowing more girls, but at the same time, you want to continuously be meeting new women. You understand? So don't be on some, like, you know, let's say you're part of some club or something like that. And you are, you're just focusing on those, two girls or that one girl in your in your club and you're trying to get her and you've been you know spending the whole semester just trying to get with her Nah, don't even do all of that you should spread your situation around make that happen um you know you should also take advantage of the fact you got the social circle there the girls know you but at the same time do not uh just do that you know you understand you should go around talk to other women um, talk to other girls that you don't know, introduce yourself to other women you don't know, because that girl you're talking about that's in your social circle, you know, it could be a situation where it don't work out or, you know, nothing happens. Right. So you should be talking to other girls at the same time while you're talking to this girl, you understand? And just have her be, you know, another one of the girls that you're talking to. Right. But, you know, just, you know, in general, all you need to do, um, you know, when it comes to, dealing with that girl in your social circle or any type of situation like that is just, you know, invite her to do something with you when you get her by herself, then you make that move. Now, the reason why I'm saying to get her by herself and to isolate her from all the other people in your social circle is because sometimes what happens is that women, they're, you know, they're not going to um, express themselves exactly how they want to when there's all these other people around. You understand? So if you're trying to holler at her while this other girl's there and then some other person's there and then you know she's gonna probably feel self-conscious and not really react or you know uh respond to you in the way that she naturally would if you and her were together alone you see what i'm saying so you got to make sure that you have her by herself when you interact with her and then make that move all right so that's pretty much it listen if you guys have any more questions make sure you click the link below and i'll holler at you later remember the truth is inside you peace i'm gone
Now, before you turn off this video, make sure you click the link below to get the Mr. Locario 30 minute game session. Now, this is a private one on one coaching session between me and you where we chop up game for a half an hour. So make sure you click that link below to get the Mr. Locario 30 minute game session. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. Go to badboymembership.com and master the dating game by joining my bad boy membership program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step-by-step -step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy Membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.